Hello. Hi guys. I don't know who's here yet. Oh my goodness, I can hear myself. Let's not do that. All right, got my iPad ready. Yay, hi Patrick Paper Co. I don't know your name though. <laughs> hi Nancy, oh my gosh, hi Cheryl. Hi. I saw that you set your countdown reminder on, um, on Instagram. I'm so happy you're here. I know it's so late over there. But hello. I'm just getting my chair ready. I cut out some doilies. I think I have to zoom in actually. Um, but I cut out some doilies and I have to get all the little bits and pieces out. Oh, Haley. Did I say that right? Is it Haley? Hi, Dee Dee. I'm just getting all these little bits and pieces out from my um, bag toppers. This isn't working so well. Oh, there we go. Works better on this side. Oh good, I said it right. Yay! So we're going to be making the Sunny Days bag toppers. Um, so I cut out a million ephemera today. Well, maybe not a million, but I cut out a bunch because I only have like a few pieces left on my chipboard and I don't have another one. So I needed something. I don't know if I'm going to do all these for these though. Seems like a lot. But maybe we should pick our favorites. So I have these doilies. I got watermelon. I got this one. I think that one's kind of cool. This one's a little plain, but, and then this one has like a, a beachy background. And then there's this green one. But this plain one, I have a gold one somewhere. Um, I was thinking of possibly layering it. But I don't know, I'd have to like cut it down a little bit obviously, but I was thinking of possibly layering it on top of this one because it's a little plain, but I'm not really liking that either. I don't know, pick your favorites guys, which one should we do today? Which one should I craft with? Let me know. I just got all these bits and pieces right now to get rid of. You love them all? That's not helping me. <laughs> Pick a few, Haley. I gotta, I don't know if I'm gonna get through all of them. Doesn't somebody else go live after me today? Like at eight o'clock? So I feel like I need to hurry my butt up. I feel like I can't be on here all day. Pouring resin won't be typing much. Ooh, that sounds fun, Dee Dee. I think you posted that in your stories, did you? I feel like you did, because I think I saw it. Hi, Catherine! Okay, the simple polka dot one and the beach one. Okay, so we'll do those two. Do you, do we, do you think I should do it with the gold, Cheryl? I'm not loving the gold, but I just don't think it looks good. Okay, fine. Teal and white and the one you're working with. Okay. Okay, so maybe I'll do these four. This one, this one, this one, and this one. I wanted to make four. Um, hi, Patty! Alright, so I think this one's done. Alright, I was trying to get this done beforehand, before the live, but then I was cutting out last minute other ephemera. Alright, so that one's done. But I got so many goodies today, guys, from Dollar Tree. It was so great. I'm trying to make my future craft room be all pink. I blame Cheryl. She got me more into pink than I, I ever was before. Like, I like pink. But now I'm on, like, a whole other level of pink. So thanks Cheryl, I blame you. <laughs> and let me know if my bracelets are annoying because they keep banging on the table. Hi, babe! <laughs> Thanks for joining my live, babe!
Yeah, all your fault, Cheryl. So I want to do like some layered bag toppers. Um, this is taking forever just to get these little things out. It's already been five minutes of me doing this. It feels like so much longer. There's just so many little like dots in here. I love how this dye looks though. It's a dye and it's from AliExpress. I will try to link it down below, but the last time I checked it was unavailable. So maybe it'll be back again. But I needed a doily dye because I really don't have doilies. Hi Brandy! And I tried to get some doilies. I ordered some I think in like March I want to say. And they never came in from Allie, so I had to file um, a dispute. <laughs> Brandy, there's gentlemen here too. My babe is here. <laughs> so funny. All right, so we got those two, and then which one did we say? Oh, this one also. Okay. So I'm going to put these other ones out of the way. I really like the watermelon. You guys don't like that one? That's fine. That's fine. I'll do that one probably later off camera. <laughs> it's nice to see you two getting along, Brandy and Babe. <laughs> it's okay. She didn't know that you were here. Choose wisely. Hi, Josie. <laughs> Thanks for joining my live. We're making those bag toppers today that I was supposed to make last week. I really hope the person that I'm making these for is not here. Because these are going to be going after her. So, I hope she's not here. Yes, I love this dye too. It's so cute. I'm going to try really hard to look for it on AliExpress. <laughs> Hi, Carolina's babe. Yeah, so I'll try to look for it on Ali and I'll try to link it. Um, I think it's so cute. Especially when you don't have a stash of doilies. Because I don't. I wanted to. But like I said, they never came in. So then I just got a doily dye instead. And it works because I could just use whatever paper that I'm crafting with. And it'll always match with the collection that I'm using. Alright, last one guys. I got these little like dots all over the place. See, this helps a ton though. Look at this. Look at all those little dots flying out of it. Maybe I just needed to be rougher with the other two. not like in these dots. Josie, you made the mini album? Already? I've been waiting to make one. Just waiting for Cheryl to make a video. Oh, you're making it for Wanda's challenge. Ooh, fun. When does um when is the last day to send in stuff for her again? Because I wanted to enter that challenge too. Ooh, that one was so much easier to do. Okay. So, oh my gosh, now I gotta fold these. So last time I did these, I just kind of scored it, but that's too much work. So I think we're just gonna fold it like this this time. 
and I should probably get my phone folder for this. Okay, Mommy and her four little ladies. I know your name this time is not Raquel, and I'm pretty sure it's Adriana. <laughs> Let me know if I got it right. After you shouted me out in Ada's video and said it's not Raquel or something like that, I forgot what you said. I was like, oh my goodness, I need to remember. Oh my god, it's <laughs> okay. Please tell me you're not messing with me. Oh my gosh. It's not Gabby. It can't be Gabby. <laughs> I swear I thought it was Adriana. Oh my god. Are you messing with me? You guys messed with me last time and I'm confused for forever. Oh, I did not do that one on the right line. I should have paid attention to where the paper was, but okay. It is Gabby? Are you sure? I don't know. I feel like you guys are gaining up on me here. Are you sure you guys aren't lying to me? Do I need to like, like look this up on Instagram? <laughs> she needs it before 8.19, but not sure for deadline. Well, I guess that is her deadline if she needs it before then. Oh boy. Oh wait, I have time. 8.19 is August. I got plenty of time. Alright, sounds good. I'm trying to line these up like the doilies, but I guess I really don't have to because one's going to be on the back. Are you sure you guys aren't messing with me? Is it really Gabby? I'm forever going to be doubting you guys after you guys lied to me last time. Yeah, I really thought I remembered this time. Alright, can you guys see this good? Alright, I'm just gonna... You're <laughs> Adriana Raquel. Oh my goodness! I don't know why I cannot remember your name. What is wrong with me? <laughs> it really is Gabby? Okay, I'm so sorry, Gabby. I'm so terrible. I don't like any of these pieces with this. <laughs> oh, my AC just turned off. Is it quieter now? Did you guys realize that you guys were hearing it this whole time, actually? So uh, right now I'm just picking out pieces that kind of go with the paper that I kind of like um, before I even organize them. I kind of like this one. I don't know. Maybe here. I like that one there. Let's see. Yay! Thumbs up for me! Thank you, Josie! Thumbs up for me, and maybe I'll remember your names next time. <laughs> maybe that will make me remember. Oh, well, what did you change your name to? Like, what did you want to be called? Oh, I kind of like that one there, too. This is hard. Matching these papers. That one's cute. Do, do, do. I feel like this one needs like simpler stuff because the background's so detailed. Alright, I don't know. Ooh, a little ice cream. I feel like everyone's everything's going with this one. I don't know. Oh, I have um the little little bathing suits. Oh, look at this one! It's a cute little girl in like a tubey thingy, just chilling and tanning. That might be cute on there. So when I printed these, the blue ones came out so much brighter than I had wanted them to be. They're kind of like darker in the collection itself, but um, that's how they got printed from my computer. It's okay though. See, they're just like so bright. My Starbucks name is Cat. My Uber name is Ruby, and my voicemail is Zaylee. <laughs> that is so funny. I love it. I always forget to give Starbucks a different name, but my kids, my sixth graders, would always look at my name on my Starbucks cup, and they would always try to figure out my name and. Sometimes I remember to take it off and sometimes I didn't. So some of them 
learned my name because of my Starbucks cup. But it's like when I order through the app, it has like my real name. Can I change it on the app somehow? I have to like change it on the app because when I just scan the app, it doesn't um, let me change it. Thank you. Thank you, Haley. Starbucks always gets my name wrong every single time. Like, do they spell it wrong? Because they always spell mine with a C. And it's so annoying. And I'm always like, Carolina with a K. I really hate when people do it with a C because then everybody calls me Carolina. And I'm like, I'm not a state. It gets on my nerve. The problem comes when you start confusing your children. My little one calls me cat. <laughs> that is hilarious, Gabby. That is so funny. Oh, look that, look that one. That one's coming out so cute. I didn't even like place these where I want them to go yet, but... Charlotte, they spelled it as Charlotte. <laughs> I feel like sometimes they just can't even like hear us when we tell them our name. I think I have enough of like sentiment pieces. <gasps> but I love this little watermelon. I don't know where it's going to go. Maybe on this one. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that one will go there. Maybe it made me They have, there's so many pieces. So I'm like trying to stick on here and layer. Oh, but that one looks good there too. Oh, but that one looks good here. But that doesn't really fit with a bathing suit and a shell. Um, oh, I have this butterfly. Oh, and this bird. Oh my God, this one, like, what is happening? There's like so many pieces I'm trying to throw onto these things, but we'll figure it out. We'll get to arranging after once I figure out what goes where. We'll see. No, that doesn't go there. I wanted to use this bag. Maybe here. Just throw it in there. Throw it in the pile. Okay, this car does not fit anywhere. Maybe that one there. Oh, wait, maybe these pink ones. No, I like those better. Oh, maybe we need to pop a pink here. No, maybe here. Did I add sunglasses here already? I feel like I did, but maybe not. We'll figure it out. Okay, and then I have like a couple of these bigger pieces. Oh, I didn't cut out any tags to layer with. Oh, well. That's okay. All right, I think I'm going to put these back. You guys like my new container? It has a lid, but I just got it from the Dolly Tree today. They have so many containers. Like, I want to show you guys what I got, but I know you guys aren't here to see what I got. But I'm so excited. Everything's going to be pink. Okay. And I have no more foam tape that I cut out myself. So I have this foam mounting tape. I, this, oh, this is from Hobby Lobby. I was, gonna, I was just going to say I don't know where I got it from, but I guess it's from Hobby Lobby. Because um, I ran out of all my other, like, foam tape that I normally glue. But I have my hot glue gun on anyway. Alright, I don't even know where to start. I need some thread and I need some eyelash trim. One moment. Okay. I got gold thread. I got some eyelash yarn trim thingamabobby. Got scissors. Okay, let's start. So, I guess we're doing this one first. Oh, these need to go back. I got it at Hobby Lobby. TikTok guy voice. I don't watch TikTok. I'm not, wait, yeah, TikTok. I'm not on TikTok. Um, and I don't watch it. So I have no idea what you're talking about, but I'm assuming it's funny. Alright, I feel like this person needs to go up here. Does the airplane fit with this thingy that says you and me? It's cute. It's mad cute. Maybe I could just layer it like that. But then I feel like this should go back here a little teeny bit. Like underneath this, maybe. Let me know. And this little ice cream, I really like this ice cream. I think it just goes like right here. Let me know if we sort of like that. I don't even know where I would put the thread. Maybe I need like a um like a ribbon oh wait we could put like pom-pom trim kind of 
But it would like show through these little dots. That's the only thing. Hi, Wanda. Thanks for joining. All right, maybe maybe I should add some ribbon. He's he mock he mocks his wife. He went viral. Hobby Lobby used his video for some type of commercial. Oh my god, that's awesome. Oh, thank you, Vanessa. I've been, um, for the past two days, I've been really into wearing, um, my jewelry. All right, guys, hold on. I'm getting some pom-pom trim. Maybe I need some lace, too. Let me just get everything out there, I guess. All right. Okay, so I got lace. I got this leafy thingy. I don't know. I, I almost feel like this one needs some pom-pom trim. Somewhere. Let me take these off. I don't know where yet. <laughs> but I did need pom-pom trim somewhere. <laughs> um, maybe at the bottom of the me. And then at the bottom of the you. I'm going to cut a piece off and we'll see. Because maybe that will work. Oh no, look what I did. <gasps> I hate cutting pom-pom trim because I got all these fuzzies. But it looks so cute. Okay, so I was thinking I got some pom-poms right here. If they weren't looking off Fuzzy, let's turn it over. Okay, so maybe that one there and this one here. What do we think? How does that look with the pom poms? If you guys could even tell. Should I zoom in on this? Maybe I should zoom in. But let me know. I think I kind of like that. I think that looks cute. And then it would go on here. And I think it looks cute. Okay, good. I'm glad you guys like it because I was probably going to put it on anyway. Okay, let's see. Get some glue on here. Really? I need another glue stick? I feel like every time I do a live, I need to refill my glue stick. Oh, my AC one just went back on. Hopefully it's not too loud. But you guys were listening to it before, so hopefully it's okay. <laughs> Thanks for valuing your opinions. I value your opinions, but sometimes things look better when you're looking at them in person. <laughs> okay, so, ooh, and that added a little bit of dimension here. Did you guys like the airplane here? Because I'm thinking I like it like this. Like that. And then it would look so cute with some jemmies. I'm gonna do that last but let me know what you guys think of that and I forgot what I just went to go look for I went to go look for something what was I gonna get uh okay I don't know oh a glue stick all right I got my glue stick I also have these like super big pieces I hate ephemera and gigantic pieces, but like, look at all these ginormous pieces. How do I use these? Like, none of these match on here. Like this one, but it just takes up the whole entire thing. How do you guys use this? I'm gonna steal, um, was it Cheryl that took some of these and just put them in vellum? Did you do that, Cheryl? I don't know, or maybe just acetate. Because these need something, but then I really don't know how people would use them. Alright, I'm not even going to play with that because we're not using them. But let me know what you guys think of this. I'm going to get started on the next one. But let me know if we like that. The larger pieces in a tag clip. I already made a tag clip and I used so many of them. Like, I have so many still left. Oh, my dog's trying to get in here, but I have all the stuff I just bought all over the floor. I'm so sorry, boo-boo. Let me move it for you. Oh my goodness. Alright, you could join me now. Bigger pieces to decorate gifts. Like gift bags? Or like like bags that you make? 
good for background layering. They are, but they're just so gigantic. I feel like they're even too big for this. Okay, how did I, how do I want this? Oh, I, I wanted my black and white flowers. And I bought like this stuff to use, but like none of this even goes with sunny days. Like, it's, it's not working here. Okay, now what was I gonna get? Oh, my flowers. All right, I got these flower thingies. Did you guys decide if you like this one or not? Oh, maybe some gold leaves behind this one. Got these gold leaves here. How's that look? Funky? Maybe a little bit? Or for mini albums. Yeah, I think on mini albums it would actually look good. I wasn't gonna make a Sunny Days mini album. Does that look better with a little bit of gold? I feel like that leaf is random. But at the same time, I kind of like it. Let me know. Alright, we got this thing here. I'm trying not to block this, but I feel like I like it. Let me know. Um, here, I'm going to try it, try so hard to use one of these. Let's see. I need a plain one. Oh my god, they're just so big. Oh, I could cut this one down. That one says, hey sunshine. I guess I could cut that one down, but at the same time, I kind of like this for something else. I just don't know what. I would feel bad cutting that one. Here's this one. This one's so ugly. How do I use this? Can I use this on this on this thing? As it as add it as a background piece. Oh, I have a tag. I do have Uno tag. That was in here. Let me see. Oh, I got another tag. Oh, I got this one. This is the life. This pink tag. Every moment with you is my favorite. No. Like I want, I want to use these. Otherwise, they're just gonna sit in the in a box, and they're never gonna get used. Oh, there's this cute little post party one. Alright, let me try to piece those in somehow. I don't know. But I'm thinking this one might kind of look good. See, if I add it here, it literally covers, it covers up the whole doily. Okay, not cute. And this pink one, maybe. God, these are too big, and they're not even that cute. Okay. Is that too much? Too much pink. But we'll add like a flower here. And then I could get some thread behind there. Did you guys even tell me if you guys like the other one yet? You guys are slacking. Help a girl out here. Wow, that is so ugly. Let's not do that. I think it needs a smaller flower. That one's too big. Maybe it'll... No, it needs to be on here. Um, nope. I'm not liking it. Let's take that one out. Let's try this green one. Oh, that looks better. Okay. Maybe. Where does, like, this stuff pieces go? It's like a puzzle. So did you guys like this one? Can I like glue that one down? You tell me. Maybe 
maybe up there. Maybe like this for this one. But now that's too pink with the watermelon. I don't want to waste that watermelon. He is so cute. I love the watermelon. And actually, I hate watermelon in real life. But on this paper, it's so stinking cute. I feel like I need something else here. Or maybe a bathing suit. Should we throw a bathing suit in here? No, that looks weird. Maybe, where did my ice cream go? Didn't I have an ice cream for this one? I thought I did. Maybe little cherries. <gasps> look at those cherries! They look a little big. I think I have a smaller cherry somewhere here. Oh, yes, I do. Oh my god, this is so much smaller. But I think this would look good. Hi, Sandra! Ooh, what do we think of that one? I'm actually liking it now. I think it looks good. All right, so I'm good to glue this one down, right? I saw in your stories that you are a special ed teacher. My son is on the autism spectrum. Thank you and God bless you. Aw, thank you, Dee Dee. Yeah, I actually work with um, some kids that have autism. We had um, four this year. We have a nest program at the school that I work at. So I'm the teacher. I'm certified nest and then I'm also just like a special ed teacher also. Oh my goodness, those back toppers are so pretty. You're so creative, Carolina. Thank you so much, Katie. And welcome to my live. Hello. I mean, these guys weren't even done yet. These two, I think so. Um, but I feel like I want to use some pom pommy stuff. Oh, maybe this one could get some lace. Like under here. Oh, actually, I think I, I, think I like that. Let me cut some lace here. Like right under here. Go under there. Come on. Does that look cute? I don't think you guys could tell really. I'm going to try to hold it up without ruining it. Can you guys see it? Am I even in the frame? I am. Okay. So let me know if you guys like it with the lace. I think it looks cute and it's going to look so much cuter with some jammies. Okay, so we got rid of those two pieces, but we did a good job in using pieces. Okay, I'm trying so hard. Like, I'm afraid to move these around and not glue them down because I feel like I'm going to ruin them. So I feel like I should move some. Uh, not move some, but I feel like I should glue them. I think I'm going to do that. I'm so scared that I'm going to, like, touch it and it's going to go all over the place. Didn't I want to use these sunglasses? Nope, I guess not. Okay, um, alright. I feel like I want to take a picture. Somebody take a picture of this because we're about to take it all off to glue it back down. <laughs> I'll try to remember how this goes. Okay. We'll see, but this little leaf goes first, so that one's not going to be popped up on foam. But we're sticking him ow that's hot okay we are sticking him down okay um this was supposed to go here somewhere how do you glue this thing it's so thin but i don't want to use um other glue. It's just going to take too long to dry. Alright. I think those were like that. I hope. Then this one's going to get some foamies. And this other piece that's cut down already. Thank you guys. I'm glad you like them. I don't normally make bag toppers, so, oh my god, do not take my nail polish off. Guys, I did my nails yesterday morning at 9 a.m., and seven hours later, they were not dry when I went to film a video, and I was opening up a box, and my nail kind of got caught on the box, and it left a dent in the nail polish, so it wasn't even dry. Seven hours later it was redonkulous 
I blame Anna because she recommended that nail polish and it wasn't drying. Nope. It was not. Oh no! The glue went through the holes. Um, I had the Expressy on. It lasted a good amount of time. It was three and a half days before it chipped and I didn't have a top coat on. So it lasted a good amount of time. I just only had that one color and I wanted pink, which my babe just bought me some pink and he got me some. So I got it. I'm going to try that next. He got me some pink expressy cause I'm loving it. And he found the top coat for me too. So I'm excited. Go baby. He got it for me. But the Expressi was amazing. It dried so fast and I love it. Never again when am I trying this gel nail polish. I'm like so close to just like throwing it out because, and but like I just bought it so I feel so bad. Cause you know, it's just like money being wasted. It's a pretty color. I'll give it that. I like the color, but it just wasn't working. I'm not going to be waste, like waiting a whole entire day for it to dry. You didn't find the Expressi? So I saw it at CVS originally, but the one that I ended up buying was in Target. So maybe try Target. I don't know if you have a Target near you, but um, I don't even know how much it was. Babe, are you here? Do you know how much it costs since you just got me one? <laughs> Do you have the receipt? How much was the Expressi nail polish, babe? Nine dollars. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> That's not bad, guys, for a nail polish. That dries so fast. It literally dried within a minute. It was so good. Even if it were to chip, I wasn't even going to be mad. It, it didn't. But even if I was, like, I wouldn't even be mad. I would have just repainted it on top of it because it just dries so fast. It's, like, fantabulous. Um, where am I adding gold thread on this thing? Am I even adding gold thread oh babe you're so sweet i love you he said anything for babe it was part of my finishing the school year present <laughs> and then babe said he's making something for me i have no idea what he's making me so he might even be crafting right now as he's watching this live. <laughs> All right, so this is gonna go here. That looks cute. I don't know where the thread is going, but I feel like it should go behind here. So I'm gonna get um, my thread for this. This tape is hard to peel. Maybe I just don't got the right nails for this. Come on now. Come on. There we go. Are you guys still typing or are you guys quiet right now? Because if you are typing, I don't see it. But if you're not typing, then tell me you're not typing. Okay, I really don't, I really don't, I don't know. Maybe you guys aren't typing? I don't see anything. After my babe said anything for babe, I see nothing. Oh, thanks, Dee Dee. <laughs> I did see that. Okay, you guys are just quiet. Okay. Oh, wait, I wanted um, gold thread on here. I almost glued this down. All right, let's see. I need the AC to go back on. It's like on auto hate when it does this. I don't know how to just leave it on because it just keeps turning on and off and I need it back on. It is so hot under these lights. 
But at least the lights aren't turning off today. Oh, what are you making, Haley? Thank you, Josie. Okay, let me glue. I'm trying to pick paper for a 3D project you want to make tomorrow. Are you making a TV, Cheryl? Are you making that TV? That we were talking about? A flourish house journal. That sounds so cute. Like an album, but in the shape of a house. I have yet to play with flourish. I have two of the 12 by 12s and I have yet to play with it. There's a lot of dark colors in that, but I also love all the florals in it. All right, can you stay, you thread you? That's so cute. Are you following like a tutorial? I, I, I don't know who had it. Yes, babe, that's the Cheryl I've been telling you about. She's my crafty bestie. It's one of your faves? <laughs> babe, you're so funny. <laughs> I need to play with Flourish whenever I can finish my swaps, if ever. You're famous, Cheryl. Famous in New York. Oh, that looks cute with the little thread behind there. Thanks for keeping Carolina entertained while I'm working all day. <laughs> Babe loves that I have somebody else to talk to all day long. Hi, Eileen! Thanks for joining! not reading a book today Cheryl I mean you did a lot of reading actually already but oh no you're picking out paper I want to know what project you're making yes you did Eileen thank you so much for joining I've been missing all of yours but Friday was my last day so I'll be able to join some lives Except for Monday, probably not on, mon on Monday, because I'm going to be um, watching my nephew all day on Monday. I'm excited. But if he's sleeping, I could probably join the live. Yeah, she goes live so early. Eileen, do you need to, like, do another time for lives? I mean, you don't have to actually anymore because I'm free for the summer. So exciting. So exciting. Yeah, I'm watching the cutie little patootie. He's so stinking cute. I love him. He makes kissy faces all day long. Look, guys, look how cute this turned out. And then we're going to add some bling. Oh, my God. Did I glue this together again? Oh, no. Okay. Hold on. Um, so there's this bag topper. Look how cute! Oh, I love it! And then it's gonna get bling, but it's looking good, guys. Looking good. Thank you, Haley! I'm really liking it, too. It's like, once you add dimension, like, this looks so boring. So, let's look at this, okay? This looks boring and flat, but then once you add all the dimension it's gonna look so good okay so just remember that yeah it's a doily die from aliexpress hi marie did i say that right is it marie or is it mary no i think it's marie um yeah so it's a die from aliexpress i'm gonna try really hard to find it but somebody asked me about it recently because i did send it out in a swap um like i used it to make some bag toppers in a swap and they didn't have it available anymore, but I'm hoping they've maybe brought it back. So if I could find it, I will link it. Why don't I use my thingy mabobby from Tuesday morning, like that, that mat? 
Why don't I use that, guys? I should use it, right? I just, like, I think I'm not using it because I really want it to be pink. And it's, like, the mint color. But I really want it to be pink. So that's probably why I'm slacking. Okay. Um, I feel like I want some eyelash trim. Let me cut a piece of eyelash trim here. And I almost feel like I want it behind this bag. And get my finger thingy on. You like the watermelon paper? You're way late. I asked like a million times, girl. I love that watermelon paper too, but nobody wanted it. But if you guys are loving the watermelon paper, maybe I'll make another bag topper after this video. And maybe I'll do a giveaway at the end of this. And then somebody could win one on the watermelon paper that I'll just do off camera. what else am I going to do, you know? Hi, Sydney! So, do you, for resin, what do you need to buy for that? Just resin and then, like, molds? And you create, what, charms? Is that what you're doing? Are you sending some my way? Making resin letters. Yes, molds and resin. Are they charms? Oh, wait. This one needs a tag. Wait, was a tag before this, after this? I feel like maybe this should go back here. No, it's going to go here. But we're going to cut it down because we don't need all that flower piece. So this way, this could just go here. It's almost 1 a.m. here. We'll catch up on your bag toppers tomorrow. Good night, Cheryl. Thank you so much for joining. I'm so happy you got to catch a live. I know it's so late for you, but I appreciate you joining. You're going to make them into charms. You have purple Okay, I don't want any anymore. I don't like purple. You could have them. You could keep them. <laughs> but you know who likes purple? Eileen likes purple. So, if you have any that you don't want, send them to Eileen. I remembered that you like purple. I can't remember names, but I apparently could remember people's favorite colors. Carolina, read chat. Okay, hold on. What am I missing? Um, I got that glue gun. I love it. Yay, I'm so happy, Brandy. I'm so happy you love the glue gun. It's amazing. Dee Dee, I forget. Do you have a store? Oh, for the resin? Does she have a store? What am I, what else am I missing? I was on Alley today. I filled my cart and went to check out and then had to rethink my cart now it's sitting there. <laughs> I ordered from Alley like a million stuff, uh, was it last week, I think? Um, because they had the sale. Sandra, what am I missing? I don't feel like I'm missing anything. Gigi said she made an eye an eye in purple for Eileen. Oh! I saw the purple eye, but I didn't understand that it was for Eileen. <laughs> oh, how nice! So, are you making like a K for Carolina? <laughs> okay, let me put this here getting some lots of dimension my favorite colors are pink and gold and mint 
but I've been really into pink lately, so. But I still like my gold. I will always love my gold. I mean, look, look at my rings, they're all gold. Yay, are you sending me some? <laughs> oh my gosh, Gabby. Yes, you need an R for Raquel. <laughs> and then you also need um, an A for Adriana. And then you need a K for Kat. And oh, I forgot what the other one was. You had another name. <laughs> so many names my favorite name is Cecilia that's like my favorite name don't ask me why I don't know why it just is yay this is looking so cute I feel like I need some thread. No, we need some thread behind here. So actually I need some, what I realized guys is that double-sided tape is so much easier when you want to stick thread on instead of hot glue. I could call you whatever, you'll take it. Oh, they're doing resin tomorrow? I know they're doing a live together. Are they like, is she, is um, Anne going over Wanda's house? To do this? To do the live? Right? I've burned my finger so many times, Eileen, trying to just put hot glue and then put the thread and I figured out that I could just be using double-sided tape. Oh my god, it's only an hour and, I mean, it's been already an hour and I've only made two bag toppers. Okay, I must be really slow or something. I consider myself a slow crafter. No wonder Cheryl said it's almost 1 a.m. there. Here I am, just like a la di da No, split screen. How are they doing a split screen? I want to do one with Cheryl if I could ever convince her to do a live. I was telling her about that. But I was like, I don't know how to do it yet. But I want to. I get lost in crafting too, talking too much on my end. I'm talking too much to you guys. I should just stop talking to you and just craft. Um, I think they're going live at 7 p.m. tomorrow, Eastern Standard Time. I think that's pretty standard for Wanda's lives. I think that's what she does. But correct me, guys, if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Sunday tomorrow. IG or YouTube? I thought she was doing YouTube. Hi, Kayla! Yeah, that's what I thought, YouTube. But how are they doing a split screen? How do you do a split screen? Is there an option like that on YouTube? How was your work day? Wait, what time is it over there? It's 8 o'clock here. What time is it over there? Oh, this one's so layered. Um, oh yeah, my sentiment needs to go on now. Oh wait, I need a lot of layers. One, two, okay, three layers of foam need to go on the end here. It's so busy here. Well, everybody is trying to go get some pretty nails right now. How long have you been on YouTube? 
Uh, that's actually a long story. So I've been on YouTube for forever, but I didn't always craft. I didn't start like my crafting videos till like really like till like last summer where I was like crafting a whole lot before, way before, um, I used to do makeup videos and then I also wanted to do like cooking videos and I did some juicing videos and then I did some like DIYs for like gift ideas and I made like some bath bombs on my channel and they smelled so good and then I started making some for myself just to have um but I've done like literally every kind of video you could possibly think of and now it's just crafting because now that's what I'm into so that's what it is they can do up to eight or nine people how it's just like a split screen on YouTube? I don't understand like how that works. Sounds amazing. Like I don't even know where that option is on YouTube. Eileen makes two 3D projects, embellishments, and has her Cricut cutting the next project all in one hour. Me and the other Plugs in my glue gun, wonder what I want to craft, it's time to go back to sleep. <laughs> That's so funny. Wow, Eileen, you're, you multitask like that much? Through StreamYard? Is that an app, Wanda? I want to do one. This sounds so fun. still learning yourself I'm sure I'm sure you are it just sounds amazing though okay I feel like I need some more dimension in there because that's a little floppy you're an awesome crafter too girl I usually come on and don't have any projects organized the same way sometimes I just sit there okay yes Kayla I do that too except that I end up doing that for like a whole day sometimes I just sit there watching lifetime still thinking about what it is I wanted to be crafting and then I just don't craft and I'm just sitting there no the doilies are a die from the AliExpress store but I'm going to try to find them afterwards. I just don't know if they're going to have it because the last time I looked, they were um, no longer available. But I will check again, and if they have it, I will link it. My silhouette would never cut these little itty-bitty intricate things. I don't know what it is, but when I cut intricate things with my silhouette cutting machine, it just like tears and rips the paper and... I don't know if I need to go slower, but that's just annoying because then it cuts slower and I don't know. I still like feel like it rips the paper, but I did notice that certain papers make a huge difference. Like some papers rip more easily when you cut them in the cutting machine than um, other papers. So paper does make a huge difference. And I thought I had good quality paper um, because it cost an arm and a leg but apparently not not for little things for big things i have some paper that's great but for little things nah -uh. not so great i have a swap i should be working on instead i'm on my couch watching your crafts <laughs> i do that all the time oh my goodness literally sometimes i'm just sitting here in my craft room but i'm watching like a lifetime movie or I'm watching Netflix or just some other random stuff. All right, so this is the second one. And okay, we need to organize these guys. Do you guys got time? You got time for this live? <laughs> we still got two more to make. Should I use another girl? I used to one already, but should I use another? You only started crafting today to so stop shopping on Allie. 
<laughs> That's funny. I still shopped today. But I went to Dollar Tree and I went to Michael's. It was good. Oh, this hat is going to look so cute, I think, on her. <gasps> Can we put a hat on her? Does that look cute? Does she look cute in a hat? The hat's a little big. Obnoxiously big. Um, but maybe. Alright, I'm going to catch up. Um, I think we're all guilty of that. You ordered a hooray kit from Happy Little Corner. I have not gotten it yet. The mail is super slow. Oh, I love hooray. I have so much of that paper. Okay, that's a little big. <laughs> yeah! My my puppy, my doggy. He took out the beads. He always thinks there's something in there for him. Let me see. Do I have a smaller hat? Um, maybe there's another hat in here. I'm not going to print and cut another hat, but... I don't think there's another one here. Um, we bought the small acrylic cubes for storage from Michaels. Bonus showed them on IG. What acrylic cubes? Send me a photo on IG. It would be cute, but that's a whole entire piece of paper. Oh my gosh, here we go with the lights. Um, that's a whole entire piece of paper that... I would need to be print and waste just to cut out a hat. Um, this ephemera is a digital, so I bought the digital, I paid for that, and then I printed it and cut it here at home. What printer do I have? I have the Epson Workforce 7720. Uh, it's gigantic. It's 40 pounds. So, do I recommend it? Probably not. And I get a new one like every year because it breaks. And the only reason I keep rebuying the same one is because I stock up on the ink when I have like staples rewards. So, therefore, I keep rebuying it. It's only like a hundred bucks. But I mean, I should just like finally find another printer. It's just like because of my Etsy stickers and stuff, every printer prints and you know, like the colors differently. So I don't want the colors to change with another printer. Um, no, I don't have a Cricut, and no, I don't have a Brother Scan and Cut. I have a Silhouette Cameo. So I use my Silhouette Cameo to cut these. Um, a lot of people asked me to do a tutorial today after showing it on my Instagram, so I will probably do that on my YouTube. What if I put the hat behind her head? Still weird, right? Still weird. I like this bicycle, but I feel like it needs to go underneath here. I bought a new printer and it's amazing. It was pricey but worth it. Uh, what printer? Do we like this bicycle here? Thank you, Dee Dee. Wait, the square ones for what? Oh, are you talking about the um, the containers? Do we like that bicycle there? I think it might be a little too much. Let's take it out. Too slow, guys. Too slow to respond. But how do you like the hat um, behind her head? Okay, now you say yes on the bicycle. <laughs> okay, I'll put it back. <laughs> what if you take out the girl and replace it with the bicycle? But she looks so cute. Bicycle in front. But I like this leaf here. I really was liking the leaf. Okay. Bicycle in front. Can I keep the watermelon? I think the watermelon is so cute. Not crazy about the hat. Okay. Hat is out. 
Um, you have the Cricut Air 2, just never printed things yourself. You own the digital kits of Maggie Holmes. You just need more help understanding the best way to print and if it's worth it. I think it's worth it, especially if you don't want to buy um, um, the chipboard. Like, I'm down to, like, the like chipboard could get expensive, guys, especially if you're not finding it on Tuesday morning. But this is all I'm down to left on my chipboard. So I think it's totally worth it to print and cut your own ephemera. And you could just layer it with foam. Umbrella behind the girl. Okay, let's see. Maybe if I move the girl down a little bit and then the umbrella behind her. How does that look? Oh, that actually kind of looks really cute. Thank you. But let me know if you guys, the rest of you guys like it. I think it looks cute. Good idea. Okay. Um, I feel like this needs something else. Can I? This is too big. Where did I put my camera? Yay! Okay. Glad you guys like that. Um, no, not that. How is this? You grab my hand. Let's go. Is that cute right there? Oh, I think I like it. I think I like it. Let me know. It says, grab my hand. Let's go. So cute. Babe, are you still here? Grab my hand. Let's go, babe. <laughs> yes, I like that it brings more yellow in. Okay. Okay, good, good, good. We're going to start gluing this down. Yay. Okay, I think this, this piece will be sitting on here flat. Okay, um, this watermelon, I kind of want to pop him up on some foam. This is going to be mad dimensional. A series challenge that is color themed. Oh, like try to stick with like one color. I'm trying not to forget the order here. <laughs> yes, no purple. No purple. Uh-uh. Oh, wait, this goes next. No purple. If you want purple, Eileen's going to have to do the purple. Uh, bye, Haley. Thank you for joining. Enjoy your night. Well, I could tell you who could do pink. Cheryl could do pink because she crafts everything pink and it looks gorgeous. Me? What color would I do? I don't know. Can I? Can we do two colors? Can we do like pink and gold? Wandy, pink is her last name. Um, is it? I mean, yeah, Wandy likes pink too. Oh my gosh, where are you, Marie? What country? That's so scary. I feel like it's going to start spreading everywhere again, to be honest. It makes sense that Josie got my name wrong and she's a mod on Carolina's channel. Didi, do you want to be a mod too? I can make you a mod. I put too much foam here and I'm trying to cut it off. Laura, um, wait, where? You're in Texas. Oh, yeah, I heard Texas is really bad right now. Um, I heard some other states too. I don't know. I forgot what though. Florida's getting bad too. I did hear Florida also. Oh my gosh, Eileen, I hope it comes out negative. Did I miss a mod? Do you have a page? Um, I, 
Josie is a moderator. She's just a moderator on um, here on this channel or on lives. Be ready, ladies. Buy your TP. <laughs> Bleach hand sanitizer, water. Yeah, it's getting scary. I mean, even worse than it was before. Okay, I'm cutting some of this bicycle. This offset is a little too big. The wheels are looking ginormous. I don't know if you guys could tell, but this bicycle is also not the best quality. So as much as I love digitals, um, I hate the gray line that comes around these pieces. It's almost as if they create the chipboard and then scan the chipboard and it has like those shadow gray pieces. It's like that's what it feels like um, when they do this. And then it's also not like... You, like the best quality it's not like high quality clip art because you can't really blow it up and have it still look good so this one's like a little fuzzy I don't know if you guys could tell like the image isn't crystal clear on this one because I blew it up a whole bunch it was supposed to be teeny tiny oh what am I missing my son is in Austin and oh I wish he would come home Aww. I hope they all are safe over there. Um, Gabby says, my husband and I are stocking up, up again. I have the feeling we will be in, in stay home lockdown again. Guys, my light again. I mean, to be honest, guys, as much as it's nice going to these craft stores, I'm also loving working from home. So if I could work from home next year and teach from home, I would be so happy. Like, that sounds so amazing to me. I wanted to visit my family in upstate New York for the quarantine, but I was afraid I couldn't come back to Florida. That would be scary. You probably wouldn't be able to. Are, are they doing like a 14 day quarantine? <laughs> I wish Carly's ghost would wait until the lives are over, right? Wouldn't that be nice? It would be. It would be so nice. I don't get it. How did I film a two-hour live that first time and nothing was wrong with my light? And now it's just like the light after an hour and 13 minutes. It's like, okay, I want to act up now. Okay, I feel like I'm going to add thread behind this I should have done it with a double-sided tape <laughs> I mean this is sticky but I feel like double-sided tape just works better <laughs> ordering online is so much easier to go broke yeah but you know what you also probably don't order as much because you realize you or maybe you don't want to pay shipping or at least I didn't I, I don't feel like I ordered that much online during quarantine just Aliexpress but I didn't order like a lot of big stuff. I really didn't order paper. And it's like when I go into stores, I buy paper because I see it and I'm like, yes, but like I don't really look for paper online. So I feel like I definitely saved money. My kids are gonna be homeschooled until we feel safe. Yeah, that's awesome. Like, I can I like choose if I just wanna work from home forever? Like, I want to teach from home for forever. Because, like, at the same time, they're thinking for next year to do half days for the kids. But then it's like, I take um, three trains, really, to get to the city. So I take the Long Island Railroad, and then I take two subways. So it's like, yeah, I get it that the kids would have a half day and they would be more safer because they also, like, most of them, like, live in the neighborhood. But then what about the teachers? Oh, bye, Wanda. Don't forget to pass by tomorrow to see uh, and make resin. Yes, I'm definitely going to stop by tomorrow. Definitely stopping by. Okay, where did this go? This goes here. They need to get their stuff together in all these states.
can't look at my text messages right now, but my baby's talking houses. All I see is just like popping up on my iPad. We were looking at some houses today. Um, again, we saw like four houses today. And one of them, let me tell you guys, one of them was only nine minutes away from Tuesday morning. And it was so beautiful, but out of my price budget, I just wanted to see it. <laughs> but it was nine minutes away from Tuesday morning. Isn't that like a priority? Isn't that worth the extra money? I think it's worth it. I'm not so sure my babe thinks it's worth it just for Tuesday morning. But like right now, I am currently um, like 30 minutes away from um, a Tuesday morning. Wait, no, 40, mi 40 minutes away from the closest Tuesday morning and like an hour away from the better Tuesday morning. That is so true, Mandy. I wouldn't have the money if I overpaid on a house or like tried to like buy the house that I can't really afford. I wouldn't have money to shop. But at the same time, I'm almost like willing to give up shopping for like a year um, on crafty stuff to have a nicer house. <laughs> I'm like almost willing to do that. Like I have so much paper to last me, probably probably even like two years. I probably don't even need to buy paper for two years. And that's if I'm crafting nonstop. But then like once there is kids eventually, it's like, am I really gonna have all this crafting time? I probably have enough, like I, I really have enough paper for years. But it's like all these Maggie Holmes collections that she's coming out with. She just needs to stop because I just want them all. Oh, I bought three things of solid cardstock today, Eileen. They're $5 at Michael's. Um, they were $5 paper pads at Michael's. And I bought three pink paper pads. Three. Not one. Not two. I got three pink ones. Uh, fresh bouquet, I don't think it is Maggie Holmes, but it's crepe paper. You don't have a Michaels, Eileen? Where do you live? In the middle of nowhere? That sounds terrible. That sounds really bad. I mean, I could probably spare $5 paper pads, even with a expensive house I just won't have Starbucks I'll give up Starbucks for crafty stuff but I'll also give up crafty stuff to have a bigger house <laughs> Eileen lives in North Korea <laughs> lost in thin woods for real girl I don't think I can do that Sounds terrible. No Michaels? You guys are so lucky to have a Tuesday morning. We don't have any in Canada. Oh, you're in Canada? You know what? You guys have amazing chocolate. I just got some chocolate and some happy mail from Canada. And I was like, oh my goodness, this is so good. And that, what is it? Coffee, coffee crisp? That was so good. I have one more. Um, the co chocolate called, what is it, Aero? A-E-R-O. I haven't tried that one yet, but then there was like another Canadian one with like nuts and caramel. Oh my God, I was in heaven. And then I tried to look it up online and um, they don't sell it in New York, in like the US. So you guys got some good chocolate. Although I do love my Snickers also. 
Okay, Sandra says, I need look now because the sale is over today. Um, the sale, where? Online? On Michael's? They have $5 paper online? Seems fun. Um, it was a Maggie Holmes paper pad, really retro looking one. Wait, what are we looking for? I saw one today at Michael's. Oh, is it the uh, Heritage, Sydney? Because um, Michael's has Heritage. Oh, Flea Market? I didn't see that one. Nuh uh. I did not. I saw some Valentine's Day embossed papers. I saw some ugly ones that I didn't even buy. I saw um, the farmhouse one. You guys, I no longer work for Tuesday morning. I got terminated in the text message. What? That's crazy, Gabby. In a text message? Wow. What did it say? Guys, how do you like this? I think I like it. I think I like it. I think I like it. Yeah, I am so surprised at Tuesday morning right now. Oh, and I could put this one in between a moment to explore. I'm so sorry to hear that, Gabby. What did they say? But, like, how do you do that? Okay, like, first of all, you are a company. How are you going to do that through a text message? Like, not even a phone call. I get it if you weren't, like, at work anymore. But they could have at least waited to go back to work. But then, I guess with the closings and stuff, was it a store that closed down? But they still should have called you. I really want these sunglasses here somewhere, but I don't know where. Maybe right there. I saw Jen Hadfield recently, but someone took pages from the back of the paper at uh, Michael's. You know what? You probably should have like brought it to the register and asked for a discount. I saw some paper like that the other day because I saw the seals were ripped, and um, I started counting the paper. You called and spoke to an assistant manager. Alright, I'm going to try to keep this like this. Try to keep it there. Okay, I'm glad you guys are liking it. On another note, Gabby, how was it working at Tuesday morning? Did you love it? Did you spend all your paychecks there? Was it awesome? Was it as dreamy as I think it would be if I were to work at Tuesday morning? They were hiring near me and I had thought about it, but I was like, I really don't like want to go teach all day and then work at Tuesday morning. As ideal as that sounds and as awesome, I was just like, I'm not taking an hour drive to Tuesday morning afterwards. It was fun. Did you like spend all your paychecks there? Because when I worked at Pandora, let me tell you, I filled up a whole entire bracelet when I worked at Pandora. I literally just like bought everything. Bought it all. Filled up a whole entire bracelet. I'm not complaining, my bracelet looks gorgeous. <laughs> but um, I teach sixth grade. Sixth graders. And it's a special education. So I'm not in like a, like some schools do like the separate room for special education, but this is ICT, which means I have a co-teacher. So there's two teachers in a room with just students that have, um, special needs. I have a budget for crafting. It was fun to see everything first. You know, you should have told me that you work at Tuesday morning. I could have told you what I was like looking for. And then I would have paid for shipping. And you could have sent it to me. That 
would have been awesome. Me too. I love my Pandora bracelets. I think I have three now. Actually, guys, I went to um, Tuesday morning. So one day, I forgot when this was. It was like before the quarantine. Um, I went to three Tuesday mornings. My babe took me to New Jersey. And we went to all the Tuesday mornings over there because they have so many. I think a lot of them are closing down now, but they have so many. And, um, what was I saying? And, okay, so I went to three different Tuesday mornings. I can't think it put glue at the same time? Tape? What am I doing? Okay, I went to three different Tuesday mornings, and, um, <laughs> I can't finish the story. What am I doing? I can't think. How sweet, Carly. My youngest brother has uh, Down syndrome, and he goes to a special needs school. Aww. I wish, like, I wish they would do regular schools for all kids with special needs. I think it's so much better. Unless they're, unless they, you know, like, need that super, like, a lot of attention. But, okay, hold on. I need to finish my story. Um, so we went to three different Tuesday mornings. And in the second store that we went to, I actually met some craft people. We started talking about the uh, scrapbooking expo in New Jersey, and they were like telling me I should join them and I should go with them. And then I actually got one of the person's numbers, and she would tell me all the good stuff they got in that in that week. So I would tell her what I was looking for, and she would tell me what they got in. And then she would ship stuff to me. It was great. It was fantastic. So then I had like the inside scoop at Tuesday morning. I might do a petty video. Secrets of Tuesday morning. Oh my goodness. You totally should. As long as it's not in like a contract you signed somewhere where they might sue you afterwards for telling secrets sometimes they can be super sneaky like these companies so as long as it's wasn't in the contract somewhere that you're not allowed to say stuff because I know for example like Victoria's Secret I think it's like a year after you stop working there you can't say anything about them so just be careful um, yes you're the only person Dee Dee I don't hate the white border. I I don't. I mean, I could cut this closer to not have a white border, but it's just like with the with the digital pieces that everybody has that gray. That's so annoying. Oh my god, I should have put the thread on here already. But it doesn't bother me like when I'm sticking it on. As long as it's not like ginormous. California, you can get fired for no reason at all. I think that says no. It's crazy. Do they fire through text messages in California too? Like that's just so messed up. There's going to be a lot of budget cuts, like school budget cuts next year. And I'm just like... Do you people want me to not print work for the kids? Because then at that point, we should just be working from home for the whole year if there's going to be budget cuts. So then we don't have to print anything, so then they don't want to spend money on paper. Like that, I think, is the best way to do a budget cut if you're going to do budget cuts. No paper, no ink then. Everything just digital like we did. Can you guys tell I'm all for teaching um through a computer and on zoom it was honestly so great i loved it i was able to like help all the kids because i had all their work open and they were all doing different things so maybe work that they missed or work that they need help with i was able to just like have all their work open and literally help them in all these different things my 
like one one student would be learning how to round decimals and another student would be learning how to solve for x and it was great so this thread i got from scrapbook.com it is we are memory keepers it's really it's like thicker so you do not want to sew with this you definitely don't want to sew with it but it looks great for projects i love adding it like behind at the back where um what am I looking at? Are Michaels near you open for in-store shopping? The one near me is it? Yeah, so it was um, the one I went to today. I'm in New York. Where are you? Um, <laughs> I'm on Long Island, and it was it's open for in-store shopping. How cute! Are you on Long Island? I'm on Long Island. I went to a different one today, one that I normally don't go to because I was looking at houses, so I was like out east today. But the one that is closer to me was open also. I just didn't go to that one today. That one I went to, I think it was on Monday? I really want to show you guys what I got. You guys want to see? Let me know. I want to do a haul video too, but I don't know if I should because I really didn't get that much. But at the same time, um, I want to show you guys. Do you want to see my Dollar Tree stuff too, Dee Dee? <laughs> You're going to want to go shopping if I show you. So be warned. Yes, I love this doily die too. I'm so happy I got one. I'm so sad it's no longer available, but I'm happy I got one. All right, show and tell in a second. We're almost done with this one. Oh, wait, I got a lot of glue there. Wipe that off before it dries. Um, okay, I'm going to show you guys in a sec. Yay, I'm so happy you guys want to see. I'm just so excited. I got so many goodies. I want to go shopping whether I see hauls or not. My name is Dee Dee and I'm a shopaholic. Okay, well in that case, my name is Carolina and I am not a shopaholic. I just like pretty things. <laughs> the true denial of a shopaholic. I actually just found it on Ali. You did? Can you send me a link, Shanita? Can you send it to me on Instagram and so I can link it for everybody later? Please, please, please. <laughs> Same DDM with paperboard. I have so much paper, guys. All right, let me show you what I got from Tuesday, uh, not Tuesday morning, what am I saying? From Michaels. So, I feel like I have this already, but at the same time, I'm looking right now and I don't think I do. I have something similar that I got from Hobby Lobby on Monday. Um, so I got these, but I love these pink ones. Look how pretty these pink beads are. And I used a 50% off coupon. They had a 50% off today. So I love these guys. Um, then I picked up three paper pads. So I got um, all pink. They were $5.00. So why not? So this is the Blush Romance. And these are the colors. Like light pinks and peaches. So that was the Blush Romance. Then I got this one. This one's Pinks and Corals. I was really trying to find one that I already have. Um... Oh my goodness! It says it's the same, but it's not. I was trying to find this one. So, I, this is the one I had already, Pinks and Corals. But it's different colors. Oh my god, they changed that first one. They changed some of it, so it's different. Um, I knew it sounded familiar, but that makes me upset that they changed it. Um, but this is this one. There's lots of pinks and peaches. So that's another one I got. And then 
I got this one, and this one is called Sweet Berry. Just more pink. You could always need some pink. I like peach too. And then it has like a berry color at the end. So I got those three for $5 each. And then I got these two. Um, these were $10, but I had a f another 50% off coupon, so I made a separate purchase, and then I had a big buy one. Also, thank you so much, Shanita. Thank you. Um, so I got these. So I got them for $5. And I'm going to make some bows with this, so it's not, like, super thick, and you could like, fold it and manipulate it. So I'm going to cut out some bows with, um, my steel road dies. Is it a hard color, Dee Dee? I guess like peach is a kind of hard color to find. I think like solid, just peach colors is hard. Um, but in a paper pad, I think it's a little easier. All right, so that's all I got from Michaels. And then from Dollar Tree, I got this container and it has a lid. And I think it's for a sandwich or something. Yeah, it's a sandwich, but um, um, I'm just, I'm using it for like, look at this, this is great. Light your thumb wrap. I'm not going to keep it in there, but like when I'm doing projects, it's nice to have. I got this container. I don't know what to put in here, but it was pink, so I got it. Um, yeah, Kayla, they had a 50% off coupon today. Um, oh, Sydney, totally should have got some papers today. Anyway, let me know. What can I use this for? It's a good size. I don't really know what to use it for, though. So let me know. But I thought I should get it because all that stuff is going to be gone soon. But look, this is my favorite thing that I got. Look, it's a cute little pink trash can. This is the cutest thing ever. And it flips. Look at this. So great. And it's a good size. I love my tabletop one. But this one's just like bigger. I love it so much. Yay. It's so good. Um, so I got that. And then I got these beads from Dollar Tree. They're just like pink iridescent beads. And they're cute. And then I got some more of these seed beads. Because why not? Yes, the, the trash can is the cutest. So these are some just seed beads that I got. They used to have like an eight pack. And now I'm seeing more stores come out with just a four pack. Um, my Dollar Tree, the one close to me, still has the eight, but all the other Dollar Trees just have the four. Um, I got these metallic beads. I was like, oh my gosh, they're beads. Like, yes, little stars. I love this so much. And then I got these adhesive dots, and now that I'm looking at it, it says superior bonding strength, and I was hoping that these would be pretty terrible and not very sticky, but I guess we'll see. I got these tea light candles because I ordered some wax melting stuff, um, like the wax seals to make wax seals off of Alley. So I'm going to be making some of those because Cheryl was making some and now I need to make some. Um, they had this organizer and it's a, called a pencil holder and I'm going to put my Copic markers in here. So right now my Copic markers are just in a box and it's so annoying but this is actually like thinner and I can have them like all displayed. So that's going to be fun. And then I got three of these containers. I think they're little like drawers. They're so cute. So I went to one store and they only had one left. And then I went to another store and then I found a couple of more. I wanted another trash can, but they didn't have um, any more at my other store. So I need to go back to the other one. Yes, thank you, Josie. I still don't need it right away, so take your time. Um, oh, and then I got this gigantic basket. I, you know, I need to pile some more stuff on top of each other because I've got no space for anything. So I got this uh, gigantic basket, and it was great in the store because it carried all my stuff, and I didn't have to pay five cents for a bag. So that's all I got, guys. But just like this trash can, it is the cutest thing ever. I love it so much. I don't know if I'm going to put bags in here because I don't think anything's going to fit, but oh, it's so cute. 
Okay, last thing guys, we're just going to add some jemmies. Um, while I'm adding some jemmies, I'm going to have you guys pick a number, so I'll write down a number. And actually, I can't do two things at once. But I will make two bag toppers. I guess I'll make this one and this one off camera. And I'm going to ship it off to one of you lucky winners. Um, they're both green, I'm sorry, but that's the other colors that I cut out. Um, okay, so let me write down a number. The poop bags in the dock section, and mine even has cute prints. Are they big enough, though? Are the poop doggy bags big enough? Yes, this is so pretty, but I, I, I love this paper. I'm so sad that you guys didn't like it. Except for Dee Dee, she liked it. But she was too late to the party to tell me. Alright, I'm going to pick a number. One through... Um, let's do... One... I normally do one through fifty, but no. Um, let's see. One through... Uh... Seventy-five. I got my number written down. My number's on there. No. Don't see it yet. Nope, nope. No. No, no. Nope. Keep going. Not yet. Oh, Kiki got it. 43. There we go. Kiki, I, is that your name, Kiki? All right, guys, stop, 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 stop. <laughs> so Kiki got it. Um, Kiki, um, send me your information. Do you have Instagram? Can you just send me your address on Instagram? Do you even know my Instagram? I'm hoping you do. Linda, okay. So same, send me your name and address on Instagram. Okay, great. So I'm going to make these two off camera. I will mail this out to you at some point next week. And that's it, guys. Thank you so much for joining me on my live today. I was totally going to add jemmies to these, but I'm just going to do this off camera too. I'll add jemmies and we'll post a photo later. All right, thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, if my baby's still here, for joining me. Aw, thank you so much, Mandy, for joining me. Thank you for spending your Saturday night with me. Good night, everybody. Thank you so much, Kayla. Thank you. Bye, everybody.